Greetings everyone, Kafi here, and we are now less than a month away from the Kingdom Hearts 20th anniversary event, where they are certain to show us something new for our beloved series. And I for one can't wait for what Disney and Square Enix plan on showcasing for us. We've all been waiting patiently for over three years, and now with the series 20th birthday just on the horizon, we are definitely going to get a major look ahead at what the future of Kingdom Hearts has to offer. I mean, even if we don't get a release date at the event on April the 10th, we will definitely get a reveal trailer to hype us up into the coming months. After all, the 20th anniversary isn't just this event. This event is only the beginning, a launching pad to get us primed and ready for all the Kingdom Hearts goodness that lies in store. However, Kingdom Hearts is not the only Square property celebrating an anniversary this year. Final Fantasy does as well. It's celebrating its 35th anniversary this year, so Square Enix surely has something planned for this as well. Now the 35th anniversary website thus far shows off only two games, Chocobo GP and Stranger of Paradise but it promises much more on the way. And I am specifically encouraged by the website's message that in this 35th anniversary year, we will be bringing you many exciting new ways to enjoy the worlds of Final Fantasy. Please look forward to what Final Fantasy has in store. This message tells me that Square definitely has much more planned than what they're currently letting on. I'm just curious as to when they will showcase it to us, and in what manner. Will it be a Square Enix Presents, or will it be at E3 this year? Either way, just like Kingdom Hearts, Final Fantasy is sure to have a hidden gem or two released in the upcoming year as well. Now, some games like Final Fantasy XVI are fairly obvious, but there are several others that fans have been anxiously awaiting news upon, such as Final Fantasy VII Remake Part 2, the rumored Final Fantasy IX Remake, and even that rumored Tactics Remake. Now, quite frankly, a remake of just about any mainline Final Fantasy game would go over extremely well, and it would sell, no doubt about it. So it wouldn't even surprise me to hear that several different remakes are in the works, some of which we may not even be expecting. However, with two major anniversaries in the same year, naturally, my mind has started to wonder about which anniversary will be bigger, if one will happen to overshadow the other, and will one franchise see more games or content released for it? I'm really hoping that we see our fair share of both franchises, but Square Enix may not want to release too many titles to conflict with one another consecutively. It's really hard to say, but at the same time, they are hyping up both anniversaries. As always though, I want to know everyone else's thoughts on this. Which anniversary do you think will be bigger and better? Kingdom Hearts or Final Fantasy? Or will Square manage to find a way to successfully keep both fan bases satisfied? Anyways, don't be shy in leaving a comment down below. Maybe even hit like and subscribe if you've enjoyed this or any of my other videos. But most importantly, have yourself a fantastic day. May your heart be your guiding key. And happy gaming.